Hey everyone, you're listening to The Public Affair with me, Andrew G. I see someone different every episode, but do me a favor, keep it between us. I'm really sweating because that fucking sauce, you guys. <laughs> I am, I'm yeah, always man, sweating. It's, 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 it's a kicker, hot. man. It's, it's, it's a kicker. What'd you say? We're going to start. We're just going to start. What'd you say? <laughs> there you have it. Why you? <laughs> he said, "Do you want your towels?" <laughs> the salsa was so hot, Mike. It wasn't the wine this time, all right? <laughs> Remember the last time it was the wine? Sure the okay. okay. <laughs> we should leave that in. We should <laughs> tell Allison to leave that shit in. That was funny. Right. Yeah, that this will be the blooper. That's the blooper. Right. Yes. Okay. Did you put a lot of it? Yes, yes, girl, I put yeah, a whole, like, chunk in there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, guys, what's going on? It's me, Andrew G., and welcome to another exciting episode of The Public Affair. I'm really, really excited to have these next two guests on to the show. But before I get started, I definitely want to use this opportunity to thank you guys again so much for all your love and support of the show. I can't believe that we're going on almost two years and you guys still really rock with this show like heavy as F and it really means the world to me because I didn't know it was going to go on this long. But anyway, we're going, right? Um, before we get started with this delicious episode of The Public Affair, I definitely want to use this opportunity to give a shout out to just a few of our sponsors of this episode of The Public Affair. This episode is brought to you by my boy Joe Overa with Four Brothers Construction. My boy Joe Overa with Four Brothers Construction. Say it again. My boy Joe Overa with Four Brothers Construction, who provides custom home designs and renovations. He also focuses on roofing, remodeling, plumbing, tree removal, electrical work, and so much more. Joe and his delicious team of men are building affordable dream homes for you, so make sure you call the number on the screen for your next consultation to my boy Joe Overa. Thank you so much for being a longtime sponsor of the public affair i truly appreciate you bro of course the bnj refinishing with my boy frank biza who focuses on resurfacing bathtubs counters sinks tiles and more to original showroom quality he offers five-year warranty on most work and has the best prices in town my boy frank doesn't stop there because he also has inflatables a mechanical bowl a margarita machine tables chairs a foam machine and so much more frank like literally does every single thing that you ask him to he's a true entrepreneur a true hustler and a great friend thank you so much for being a longtime sponsor of the public affair with bnj refinishing of course, to Marco Scolero at Midway Nutrition, located at 511 North Hewitt Drive, who has delicious meal replacement shakes and delicious teas that I just love rolling around in. My favorites are the Honey Nut Cheerios, the Gladiator, and the Cherry Berry Tea. Oh, delicious, darling, delicious. Head over there for your next delicious meal replacement to my boy Marco Scolero. Thank you so much for sponsoring this episode of The Public Affair. Of course, to my bros David Santabanez with Alinea Real Estate. He's the number one sales agent in his office. He'll help you buy a home or sell your property. Make sure you follow him on Facebook at David with Alinea or call the number on the screen darling for all your real estate needs thank you so much to david who's been a longtime sponsor of the public affair bro you are truly truly the goat of course to my girl anika armstrong with peewee's crab cakes on the go in hewitt texas oh my goodness i'm obsessed with some peewee's crab cakes on the go serving the most authentic cajun cuisine with a wide selection of signature crab cakes pasta seafood and more my favorite of course is the blackened chicken seafood pasta that i just love rolling around in their top recommended is the southern fried catfish special <laughs> serve with seafood pasta potato salad six fried shrimp and the fish is topped with hudat sauce but we are not going to tell you what kind of sauce that is because you got to head over to 108 gym drive in hewitt texas or order online at order peewees crab cakes on the go.com to my girl nika armstrong thank you so much for being a longtime sponsor of the public affair i truly appreciate you of course to sonia's event planning and rentals with sonia childers she's an event planner that specializes in weddings quinceaneras baby showers corporate events and more um can we just also say too she provided that delicious throne chair for my new delicious cover of the public affair and when I tell you she should be on time, nice. I'm talking about two hours early on time. She ain't playing no okay. games, all right? Point appointments only, so make sure you take the stress off of planning your event off your shoulders with Sonia's event planning and rentals. Reach out to schedule a consultation at shoulders1994 at yahoo.com or call the number on the screen. Sonia, thank you so much because that, that thrown chair, I, I did different positions on it, but that's for my OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> Sonia, thank you so much for sponsoring this episode of The Public Affair. Ooh, and of course, to one of my new sponsors, Mr. Juan Morales with Waco Fencing and Stuff. Juan builds private privacy fences and chain link fences. Perfect for all that extra privacy at your house. Mm -hmm. <laughs> extra with three X's. Also builds wood duck stone patios <laughs> and gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous flower beds. Make sure you guys contact him on the number on your screen for your next consultation. He's over there basically making your, your yard look super snackish. Mm -hmm. To Juan Morales, thank you so much for reaching out to sponsor the public affair with Waco Fencing and Stuff. I truly, truly appreciate you, bro. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Again, thank you. <laughs> all right, guys. So like I said, I've been so excited to have this episode of the public affair. Um, I don't 
don't know. Can we get the, we got the tacos on screen, right? They're, they're absolutely, we don't. But anyway, they're here. <laughs> so yeah. I'll get them on screen here in a minute. Um, a lot of people have reached out for these next two guests to be on to the public affair as soon as they announce their new endeavor, Takisa Palacios. So without further ado, I would love, love, love to welcome the delicious couple, Onisimo and Lupe Palacios, to the public affair with Takisa Palacios. How are you doing? Thank oh, you, we're doing well. Uh, right. Now, they did not warn me that you let me try a freaking taco outside, okay? And I put too much of the red sauce, and now I'm sweating like a whore in church. Okay? It's, it's, yeah, it's a kicker, man. Yeah. Every, everybody tells us the same thing. Man. I only like, oh, you know, which one's the hottest? Oh, the red. Like the red. The yeah. red, absolutely. Now, if you're into spicy, the red sauce yes, for sure. Go, and yes. I don't usually sweat this much unless I'm drinking on the show mm -hmm. or I just got done getting pounded in the red. But, okay. <laughs> but, but, you know, that's for another topic. <laughs> so, that's it. No, well, it's I'm, for another day. Yeah, no. Well, hopefully tonight. I've really been trying. But, you know, my foot's all better now. So I can I can go so back now you to can move around. I can huh? go back to slut life. I'm really excited. I'm so Lupe. That's, you don't understand. I'm really excited to go back okay. to slut life. No, I have because you know I, when the foot broke, I didn't think it was gonna do that much to me, and then it did. And so you, you, have like a you can't get on your knees. You can't do nothing. Uh. Like, it's horrible. You can't. <laughs> yeah, and, and then you think you know you can, okay. Well, lay on the bed. No, it's harder. You know, it's yeah. just anyway. I'm sorry. You Dad. know what? You could have done like. Uh, <laughs> Your neck off of the bed. Oh shit! Yeah. Oh, so you're just gonna give me tips? <laughs> you know, you know married life. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh, we could talk about that. But you, well, the joke's on you because I got the tips, girl. There you <laughs> yeah. go. There and you so, go. So, if so if, if y'all need some advice, I got you because there's right. a lot, you know um, there's a lot of men and I I was hanging out with this group of men one time. I, this is a sidetrack. Um, we were at the club and their women were so vanilla. That they didn't do anything. And I, I took all the girls with me to the corner. I said, all you bitches got homework tonight. Okay. Right? And then they all, the husbands hit me up the next day and said, yeah, we love you. Yeah. yeah. I was like, yeah, if you're married, right? Like, don't you just, I, I, I should be able to do the nasty yeah. things with you. Yeah, yeah we gotta try, yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, like other men, for instance, you want to try that? Uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, why you got quiet? <laughs> uh, I'm kidding. Yeah, I'm kidding. Okay. <laughs> I'm fucking with you. Right. But, hey, uh, to each uh, yeah. the, right, yeah, right. To each yeah, I've been I've been low key wanting to try and get into somebody else's relationship as like a, a throuple. Okay. You know what I mean? Like a, like how's, a how's that threesome? working out for you? It, well, it's not because <laughs> <Okay. laughs> because then, then one of my good friends I was talking to him about it and he was like, oh yeah, no, you want to do it with people you don't know because because yeah, yeah, if yeah. it's people with you know, then it makes it weird. It's, it's right. gonna make it uncomfortable. But and stuff. not for me because there's there's like. I have like two couple of gay friends that I'm like, no, what's up? You know what I mean? But anyway, I guess everybody's a taboo. Yeah. So I'm back to the episode that's supposed to be about tacos. <laughs> um, no, I'm really excited. You know, um, when you guys announced the the start of Takisa Palacios, which congratulations, by the way, it seems thank like you, it's, I'm taking off to really, really great reception. Um, everybody, including um, Robert Archiga, who was just on this Small show, brother, who I love. Brother, yes, um, oh my goodness. Junior Banda, Jennifer yeah, Banda yes. with mm -hmm. Fatboy Michelin Botana. They yeah. said, you got to have the, th I was, I mean, literally everybody. Right. So, okay. Okay. so um, appreciate y'all, man. Here. Appreciate y'all. Yeah, no, that's yeah. how you know the city's writing for you. Yeah, okay, yeah. Um, and then you know I, this is actually our first time meeting. I mean, we're all friends yeah. on social yes. media and mm -hmm. such. Mm -hmm. And I, I've only uh, known. I mean, I know your son. Yes, you know, yeah, and Mother then. Junior. Uh, yeah, the little junior. Yeah, my, I have jokes. I'll tell you later. <laughs> I don't want to say it on the show because I promised I wouldn't. <laughs> and, then, and then, like, and then you've also are really good friends with Carlos Martinez. Yes, that's yeah, that's, yeah, that's family. Family. I've been, yeah, that's yeah. Brat family. Man. Don't you love him? Yeah, man, because that's... he's like this big, but he's a super oh, ferocious, man, he's, super he's, nice. Mm -hmm. He's the nicest person. And I've been, ever. I've been on him since before. You know, before the he started all that boxing and all that uh -huh. stuff. So you know, I know, I know how oh, much yeah. effort he's put into. It. All his training and all that stuff. So yeah, yeah man, it's yeah. He's come it's a long way. I, I told very, him, very you know what? Way. I told him I'm gonna like support you to the death of me. Yeah, for sure. He'd be yeah. wearing my shirts to his mm -hmm. competitions or whatever you call them. Yeah, yeah, all that stuff. And we actually, you know what? We added Lupe to the show last minute. Like I, I, I just uh -huh. assumed. No, I assumed that you both were gonna come together. Yeah. And then um, I was talking about it yesterday. And I was like, well, I wonder if I need to like clarify because yeah, I always, yeah. as you guys, I, I have my little notes. You know yeah. what I mean? Okay. And so when she said she was coming on, it like made it so much better. I was like, yeah, I was like, yes. Because <laughs> cool, I well, love having couples. So to me, I root for him. Yeah. So the Palacios comes from him. Okay. So um, so this is to me, this is this is him. Yeah, for he sure. He always says it's us, it's ours, it's ours. Right. And you know, of course, now we're one. So, yeah. But I was like, well, baby, even if you were to go by yourself, I'm gonna root. Yeah. I'm gonna root for you. That's always. what you're, that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah. For sure. yeah, yeah. Except these men that you have to use, then you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like we we're, were just we're talking about that. off camera. Yeah. We're okay. past that. yeah for <laughs> gotcha. sure. Hey, for so sure. can you, um, for anybody who may not know who you guys are, which yeah, right, because everybody told me to have you on the show. <laughs> can we start with Yoni Can you just kind of introduce yourself to us and tell us a little bit about you and all that? Uh well, <laughs> man, this is gonna be kind of kind of hard, you know. I've, I've never really had to do this, you know. Oh so, really? Well, yeah, it's literally so. just telling us who you are. Yeah. Okay, well, <laughs> it's super um, easy. I'm my name's Onesimo Palacios. You mm -hmm. know, uh, I'm 
26 years old, you know. Uh, Young. Yeah, I'm, I'm fresh meat. <laughs> <My name. laughs> Lupe, I don't want your man, okay? Not, anymore. Yeah. But, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, I'm man. sorry. So wait, no, you, you did at a point in time, Andrew? Did I, I never slid in your DMs, right? No. No, no not yours. Just just not until yours. recently, you know, just... You that, know, does like, it be on the show? Yeah. 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 No, never, matter of fact, you know, the, 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 the first time you actually, like, sent me a message... Okay. It was to tell me that I had won that a uh, fifty dollar Amazon. Oh, you gift did card. win a prize yeah. on my show. Yeah, yeah you were man. so excited. You know, I appreciate that. For, <laughs> because know, we real, never, man. we never really win. Okay, we joined yeah. raffles, but we never, never win. He was so yeah. excited. I don't even think that was the grand prize. I think the grand prize was like yeah. a TV. <laughs> but he was but like, it, so, you know, oh my god, yeah. 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 It's like, man, it was like, you know, I didn't. I, I wasn't expecting it. You know, because like at the end of the day, like okay. I say, you know. I've never really, I've entered raffles. Oh, that's cool. Did never, you buy, really, never really won. But, you know, right. it's just the support, you know. Did you buy like, something fun with the $50? Oh, man. We, something for you and Lupe? Or? I don't even remember what we bought. <laughs> but, you know, I think I got her something. Yeah. Oh, I, did, okay. I bought her something. Yeah, yeah. That, that's cute. That's cute. Yeah. Okay, so so you're 26 years old. Did you? Are mm -hmm. you from here in Waco? Yes, I'm I'm actually okay. born born and raised pretty okay. much. Um, I moved out of town for a while, you know, right. uh, when I was younger. And then just recently, not too long ago, a few years back. Um, I did moved out to to Baytown, a little past oh. Houston, oh, okay. right off the border. Um, yeah, so uh, you know it's it's <laughs> it was something different, but, right? For sure. But Houston's a big city, man, and and it, it's it was just a lot of trouble. You know? Oh, just, yeah. And I try to I try to leave Waco from trouble, but I right. ended up going to Houston to a bigger city and then getting more in trouble. trouble? Okay. Yeah. So you know, it's yeah. just, I just decided that that this was. This was my go-to. Yeah, for and sure. Plus, I had my son here, you know, and and I, I really couldn't be away from him for too long. Right. Is your oldest your a junior? Is that your yes, oldest that's, son? That's okay, that's my oldest. You. Yes. Yeah. Oh, so then you were away with from him when you moved yes, to Houston. Yes. Um, okay. There was there was times where I would come and and I would get him, you know, for mm -hmm. I would take him for a month or whatever. But right. you know, it's it's just not the same, you know, because at the end of the day, it, it hurts me to bring him back and. Oh yeah, not totally. be able to see him, you know. So well, and then everybody, uh, can we just agree that everybody be thinking that oh, I'm gonna move to San Antonio, Dallas, Austin, Houston. Hey, it's, it's gonna be so much more fun. But high ass rent, yeah. nothing but trouble. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know? I mean, I feel like more fun. There is more things to do out there. But well, well, if you want to go out and party and yeah. spend ten dollars on drinks, yeah. but I'm just trying to drink a bottle of wine in my house and get smashed. Like that's, that's all I want to yeah, do. That's, that's <laughs> that's, and that's, then that's, my rent here it. in Waco is cheaper, so yeah. we good. Mm -hmm. yeah, <laughs> yeah, well, it's, it's it's getting a little pricier now. Yeah. You know, it is. Yeah, we are on the come up yeah, for but, sure yeah but it's it's still a lot cheaper than, than okay. over there than those so how long places. has it been since you moved back to waco oh uh, it's been like four almost four or five years oh okay yeah, bet. okay four or five years that's what's up okay i definitely get more into your life okay, but we yes, need to sir. introduce the beauty yeah, that sure. is lupe yes. lupe is lupe jaramillo palacios yes well okay. my name is guadalupe jaramillo. oh guadalupe okay yes but you know lupe is for sure my best friend's name is lupita and she well, that's my daughter's name oh is it okay mm -hmm. yeah she hates when we call her lupe it's so cute. Yeah, I don't know why. Well, I thought Lupe was short for Lupita. I guess I was misunderstood. It, well, mm -hmm. Lupe, Lupita, it could be anything for Guadalupe. Really. Right, right. But to me, whenever they call me Lupita, I feel like a little baby. Like oh, a little okay. like kid. So Lupe is kind of like neutral. It's cool. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, but so that's my name. Okay. I'm 26 years old, too. Hot. I'm a Gemini. <laughs> oh, she's she's one of the, the astrologies, oh. red flags. <laughs> um, it's, it's a roller coaster. <laughs> But is it fun? But it's fun. It's oh, fun. Oh, oh, that means she's giving you good rides. That's why I said it's, it's Oh, my God. Coaster. I'm going to love this one. <laughs> <laughs> Screw the tacos. <laughs> <laughs> the freaking red sauce. Yes. Okay. That damn um, red sauce. Yeah. So I was born in Mexico. Oh, okay. What part? Estado de Mexico. So okay. yes. Mexico City. Mexico City. Mexico yeah. I'm Mexico banned. State. I'm banned. Well, I don't yeah, think I'm banned okay. anymore, but I did get banned from one time. <laughs> was it the, the being gay as fuck? Okay. <laughs> Basically oh, no. turning out the they, men they, <laughs> oh, and then getting run out of the town. They're darling. missing out. They're missing out. I, I painted that town red. I don't give a damn. Okay. Yes. Zero apology. Yeah, That's there it. You go. I went out there to leave my mark, go. girl. Okay. And you sure did leave it, huh? I sure yeah. Yeah, I did. <laughs> and I left Damn. him there too. But anyway. <laughs> okay, so you're from Mexico. When did you get here to America? Uh I was two. Oh, okay. So I've been here pretty much all my life. I got you. Yeah. What, what, you know, I like to ask this question. You right. know, I'm Puerto Rican and I'm from New York, so I wasn't really exposed to like the immigration with the Mexico right, and all that right. until I moved to Texas. Honestly, I wasn't. Mm -hmm. um, and so when I hear y'all stories about like crossing over and stuff like that, it's like it's really, crazy. it's crazy. Yeah. And it's like admirable to me. Right. You know what I mean? How people can come from like nothing and then yeah. like build Ew. this um, this empire. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So w would you say that your family kind of relates to that? Most or? definitely. Yeah? Most definitely, okay. Yeah, because uh, man, it's, and I was thinking, I was like, oh my God. Mm -hmm. So 
my dad and my mom, oh, shout outs to them because I yeah. love them. Yeah, for sure. Um, my yeah. And mm -hmm. uh but I remember they will they will work and mm -hmm. you know, they're they're new, they were new, so they didn't really know much about like the buses or yeah. you know, taxis or nothing walk like in. that. Right. The language, walk. the fact they didn't know English. Right, so. for sure. So everywhere my dad would go, he would carry me everywhere. Yeah. I mean, he would just go like hours walking and he'll carry me. And uh -huh. sometimes he'll be at work and I'll have to stay with him and I'll oh, just be wow. like in a little corner somewhere with him. And now he's a, he has his own business. Oh, good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And man, I, I feel like he he's someone that you can definitely look up to because mm -hmm. he they've yeah. been through a lot. But right, they, right. you know, like you said, they build something, something, and they're pretty good where they are now. Right, yeah. God, well, know. so what does your dad do? do concrete. I, concrete. Do mm -hmm. I know him? Do, uh, do, do hot meals. Meals. Hot hot meals concrete. concrete. God, I feel like I know like twenty hot meals. Like, okay. really? I know. Hot I, meals I, such a like yeah. a weird last name. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I feel like I know all these other people. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, okay. Yeah. So you guys, so you pretty much like grew up from that. You know what I mean? Right. So are you are you good to be here now? Like, how does that all work? I yeah, mean, no, like yeah. legally wise, yeah. Yeah. I'm, okay. Got you. We're pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I I, I don't know if DACA. that was like too personal. DACA, no, no, you're a no, dreamer. No. Okay, yeah. yeah, okay. I'm a dreamer, all right. No, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and she's like, look at that. Damn. It's exactly while we're here. You want to know what? I I, turned, I see this episode turning into something completely different. <laughs> Y'all didn't come over here to talk about tacos. tacos. They came over here to talk no, about a different kind of meat. Yeah, that's that's the main go-to. That's yeah. the go-to. Okay, I got you. Okay, so 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 you are a dreamer, and now you guys obviously you've been together for how many years? And we're, um, we're going on too. Yeah. How did you, I, I, I just love having couples so, on the show because I love, like, so, I live like here. So this, this yeah. is, the, this is the crazy thing, you know, like Tell a little us. bit let of, us, from let us, us have it, baby. So, <laughs> so, you know, it's, it was, it was actually my son's birthday party. Oh, okay. It was at the park, you know, and, and yeah. one of our close friends, you know, she, she pulled up and, you know, well, they were with her, uh -huh. and, you know, they're, they're her friends as well, you know, so. So she came, you know, and, and you know, I, I noticed her, you know, as, as, yeah, soon, as, yeah. as soon as she pulled up. Andrew, I was so ugly that day. Were you really? And, and, you know, I was <laughs> just going through it. And but I was but like, it's like, you know, you know what they say, right? You know, it's like, like when a woman's at, like at her worst, you know, she's yeah. the best, you know? Is well, that what they the say? Worst now. Oh, I don't she was, but she was, no, 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 by far. No, 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 yeah, no, okay. by far. No, she, she, she was, she, she said but, she was She was bad. looking like a hot mess yeah, express yeah, is what but, you're saying. But she wasn't, she wasn't. So, you know, yeah, but uh but yeah, so you know, one thing led to another, and, and okay. you know, she didn't speak to me or whatever. You know, I, right. I would take them drinks. Damn. Like, like, all right, thanks. You know, whatever. He was and then just, the and then just, you know, just he he is from North Waco. Okay, <laughs> like, that's what they do. <laughs> and so you know, it's but but then then um her son, my my stepson. You yes, know yes. Saying? So he ended up with like, oh, well, you know, my mom thirsty. Well, go tell him to give you something to drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, the me. Party man. Yeah, yeah. so, you know, <laughs> me, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh, that's, that's, that's her son. Okay. Okay, okay. So, Tell you know, okay. he comes up to me like, hey, uh, like, hey, uh, I'm thirsty. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That little voice, I'm thirsty. I'm thirsty. <laughs> uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm like, okay, what you want? You know? Yeah. He's like, I want that one. And he points, he points at a big blue. Yeah, yeah. And so, I'm like, all right, cool. You know, so I serve him up and everything. I'm like, here you go, you know? Yeah, yeah. And then all of a sudden, I feel like this is getting I, good. Okay. I hear her. I hear her just scream. She's like, "What did you say? Did you say it? Thank you." <laughs> oh, and then, he got, and, yeah, yeah. And, and he's he, yeah, they, they, yeah. He has manners. Okay. And you know, and and I, I, I like, yeah, he said it. You know. Oh, okay, got you. Oh, so she was trying to check her son. Yeah, she was yeah. on you know, purpose yes. because she was trying to shoot her I, I shot think, too. That's, no. what that's what it sounds I like. Think to that's me. what it was. Okay, yeah. because I'd have been anybody else, Luke. Okay. Okay. So, yeah. <laughs> Let it been some bitch. So, <laughs> so you know, it's put that shit back. And then, and then <laughs> a few days later, you yeah. know, it's, this this is the crazy part. You know, it's like a few days I've later. I've always been a go getter. Okay. Yeah, yeah. She she she, she has. You know, and no. even to this day, she still is. You I'm, know, what I'm saying? fucked with that. Yeah. And so Actually, so too. you know, she was she was selling like like. Colchas, you know, like blankets, blankets. and stuff, oh, like okay. Mexican, yeah. blankets. Oh, Mexican blankets. Mexican blankets. I'm gonna need so, one. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Yeah, we got you. <laughs> okay, please. With a panda. And so, oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> we got, we, we had, we've had a uh, tigers, we had panthers. Yeah, yeah. You know, we've had all sorts of stuff. Oh, bad, bad, bad. Yeah, but, okay. uh, but yeah. So, so back up. <laughs> so she she messages me talking about, hey, I got this for you and your son. Okay. You know. Oh, the blanket. Yeah, blanket. it was a blanket. Oh, your son. It was okay. a blanket of, of of a cowboy holding his his son's hand. You know. Oh wow. And she was like, hey, you know, this would be perfect for you and your son. I'm right, like, right. Oh, okay, you know, I'm like, well, you know, me just, well, how much? Oh. And so, you know, she, she, shoots, me free, a, she, she shoots me a price. Yeah. No, no. Uh, I was going to say, she, it would have been, not, you know, I was like, oh, yeah. it was not a thirst trap. Yeah, okay. yeah. I was like, oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's it. Yeah, that's, once that's she says it. free, yeah, for sure. But no, you know, <laughs> she gave me a price. I'm like, well, you know, uh, well, I, right now, you know, I don't get paid till Thursday. You know, I'm living check to check, whatever. Uh, okay, got Thursday. All right. She's like, all right, cool. <laughs> she doesn't message me back no more. Right, right. So Wednesday
So I ended up buying that blanket and, you know, yeah. and, and, and then after that, you know, I just kept going for it and going for it and okay. going for it. And, and, you know, finally, I finally, should. I finally, I finally got her to say yes to, to go out on a date with me. Hell yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, and one thing led to another and, you know, uh, I love when was, one thing leads to another. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, he was yeah like, me uh, too. Is it first date vibes or? <laughs> Listen, I, I screw on the first date all the time. No, 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 Cool, stable place. Yeah, but for sure. I was like, you know what? I want something different now. I think I want a family. And, yeah. You know, like the whole cooter or whatever. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, I was like, well, you know what? Let's see. He was so persistent all the time. There you go. Okay. And he was like, well, what's up? Let me get the goodies. And I was like, well, what's up? Let me get the ring. And oh wow. Oh, so you had to put a ring on it before you got the goodies. Well, yeah, yeah, but, no, but it, it wasn't. It wasn't. <laughs> in reality, it wasn't. It wasn't like so much that I was just like going for that. Okay. Know? She has. She has a vibe. You know what I'm saying? That, that, that just. It was different for you. That just. That just caught my attention. Yeah, you know? for sure. And like I said, you know, she she wasn't like your typical ordinary. You know, just oh, throws it on you. No. Yeah. No, you know different. what I'm saying? Like mm. like it was our first time that we went out. You know, we we chilled. Yeah. But it was like it was nothing like sexual that you yeah, can say. Yeah. You know? No, it for was, sure. It was yeah. nothing really like that. It was uh, a different, but it, different it was it was just sit down, chop yeah. it up, talk it up, and oh well, look, this is where I come from, this is where you come from, right? You know, and and you know, and that's how I led to it. I got you. And um, at that time, you know, I, I was I was working out of town, mm -hmm. so you know, I would only come back every other weekend or whatever. So, mm -hmm. well, I was working in Oklahoma. Yeah, at the yeah. <laughs> and and so 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 this is the crazy. I was working in Oklahoma City, matter of fact. Yeah. You know, it's it's about a good five hours away. For sure. And uh, we had a work truck and everything, but. We ended up coming back, and I was like, you know what? I want to take my car. Because, you know, we were off Sunday. So, you know, I'm like, Saturday, as soon as we get off work, I'm going to shoot back. Yeah, and Oklahoma's just right there. Yeah, so, yeah, you know yeah, yeah. I'm, yeah, like, okay. I'm, I'm going to shoot back to Waco. Oof. And, and I, you know, I, I, one time, you know, I even surprised her, went to her house, dropped her off, oh, some sure. flowers and everything. Oh. And, and, you know, and she was like, well, you know. That would have got you boxed right there, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and, that would have got you boxed and, right and, there, uh, yeah. And, yeah, so, you know, it's like I say, you know, it's <laughs> one thing, you know, it's like she she gave me a, a, a feeling, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, right. like, you know. This is who you need to be with. You know what I'm saying? Mm, she gotcha. pushes. And, and to this day, you know, she's... I was working a full-time job just right. two weeks ago. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? But I was also doing... starting Trying to start the Takisa and also trying to start my own concrete business. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, so, you know, it's... And, and that's that's still a go, you know? Right, for sure. Thing, this, this is what I want to do. And, yeah. You know, I want to be a businessman and, and she's pushing me to be that man. You Got know? you. So, you know, that's why I say it's like it's... She came. It's like God had had a plan for us. Okay, and you know, and it's everything happened for a reason. Everything happened for a reason. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying. Well, you know what? Yes, I totally believe you. You know, I I tried the dating just recently, and I really thought I was gonna do what you did, and then it didn't work out, and then we didn't screw, and I was like, dude, the whole thing <laughs> fucking yeah, was yeah, a waste it's, it's of time to go. my time. So anyway, <laughs> we're gonna continue on with this, <laughs> but for now, we're gonna take a quick break, okay? And when we get back, we're gonna get to know more about how you guys started Takisa Palacios. I want to showcase the tacos here on the show. I'm gonna stay away from the red sauce for just a little bit because I don't want to yeah. sweat anymore on the show. And the green we, one's pretty good as well. Oh yeah, I can't wait. You guys, I can't wait for you guys to see these tacos. And we're going to learn more about how they're able to maintain a stable relationship and run a business together. So make sure you guys stay tuned here on The Public Affair. Hey guys, I hope you're enjoying this delicious episode of The Public Affair with Takisa Palacios, with Onisimo and Lupe Palacios. Um, before I dig into these delicious tacos with them and continue with the episode, I definitely want to use this opportunity to give a shout out to just a few more of our sponsors of this episode of The Public Affair. This episode is brought to you by my boy, my boy, Sid Rodriguez at Elite Barbershop located on Hewitt Drive. You can call the number on the screen to book or download the Cut app. They take walk-ins as well. Marcus Guerrero actually cut me up today. I look super scrumptious just like him. Chris Reyes, Santos Cordova, David Rodriguez, Isaac Chavez, Clint, and Isaiah over there as well, making you look super snackish. Thank you to Elite Barbershop for being a longtime sponsor of this episode of The Public Affair and all other episodes as well. Of course, the Banda's hauling service with Julian and Ana Banda. They rent dump trailers. You fill it up and they haul it away. They also do junk removals and tree brush removals and haul cars in and out of town. I definitely feel like it's one of those businesses that you never really feel like you're going to need and they really be needing it low-key. Mm -hmm. And then um, Julian's going to come and he's going to get you, bro. I got you. Book now with the number on the screen to Banda's hauling service with Julian and Ana Banda. Thank you guys so much. 
much for sponsoring this episode of The Public Affair. Of course, the J. Pedal and Poke with Junior Fuentes, Thomas Roberts, and the entire family. Oh, I love it. Yeah. They provide delicious Japanese savory crepes mm. and poke bowls. They also have handcrafted Thai rolled ice cream for dessert. Choose from the menu or create your own like I like to do because I like to be in control, darling. Their locations are on University Parks Drive and Hewitt Drive. You can order online at jpedaltx.com. Thank you guys so much for sponsoring this episode of The Public Affair. I truly, truly appreciate you. Of course, to Lexus Auto Detail and Shine with Alex and Griselda Benitez, independently owned detail business. They take their time, but they do it right. You can set an appointment and they come to you. They got the car from head to toe, looking scrumptious. I got to watch them from outside the apartment. And <laughs> contact them with the number on the screen. Lexus Auto Detail and Shine, thank you so much for sponsoring this episode of The Public Affair. Ooh, and of course, to embrace fitness with my girls Lisette Luna and Amanda Switzer, which evidently I've been saying her last name wrong all this time. It's actually Switzer, not Switzerland. <laughs> with Embrace Fitness, they teach group fitness classes that are fun and dynamic, dialing they specialize in total body workout by Excola and by Jackie and Zumba Step. Classes are Monday through Thursday at 6 p.m. and 7 p.m. You can also contact them to rent the building out for parties, small events, you know, quinces, baby showers, all that stuff. So Lisette Luna, Amanda Switzer with Embrace Fitness. Thank you, ladies, so much. They're going to have your body looking super snap this summer i truly truly appreciate you ladies thank you thank you oh and of course to one of my new sponsors he was on episode 50 of the public affair eric carrillo with alan samuels dodge chrysler jeep make sure you guys hit him up for your next new or pre-owned vehicle he even offers a 200 dollars same day referral bonus so if right. they buy from him when you send yeah, them right. you get 200 dollars that same day imagine okay, sending sweet. five people in one month you get thousand dollars i'm trying to do it all right um and high school graduation is coming up so you need to put that kid in a new ride yeah, right? sure. so you're not gonna hit up nobody else except mm -hmm. my boy Eric Carrillo with Alan Samuels Dodge Chrysler Jeep. Make sure you contact him on the number on the screen and get your new ride today, darling. Eric, it was so good to talk to you the other day. He was featured on episode 50 of The Public Affair, and thank you so much for sponsoring this episode of The Public Affair, bro. I truly appreciate you. All right, guys, we're going to get back to this delicious episode of The Public Affair. I get to try these tacos now and talk more with Anissimo and Lupe Palacios. Let's go. Hey, guys, welcome back to this episode of The Public Affair. Um, before we took the break, we were just getting to know more about Lupe like, and Anissimo. You like in cilantro, right? I do love onions and cilantro, oh, yes. <laughs> well, we were just actually getting to know about them as a couple and how they met and everything. And um, actually, they're dressing up my tacos because during the break, I didn't have them dressed up and they just insisted. Now, yeah. the, we're gonna stay away from the red sauce because I'm still sweating. It was really, really <laughs> spicy. Who makes the sauce? I do. do you make the sauce? Yeah. Is it because you're spicy? You got a spicy little attitude? She got it. She got spicy <laughs> little okay, bit. so this is, this is the thing. So okay. one time we went to somewhere and they were like, which one is the red sauce or the hot sauce? Okay. And I was like, the red one. Right. And they were like, no, a lot of people say the red one is the hot one, but it's never hot. It's never hot. So okay. that was my thing. I was like, you know what? Mm -hmm. My red one is going to be hot. Mm -hmm. It has to be mm -hmm. hot. You know? So is the green less hot? Is it, it is. like more? Okay, yeah, it is. It okay, because mm -hmm. I always, you know what? Like when I was new to Mexican food, I guess my my original thing was that the green was spicier than the red. Oh no! Yeah, no, because okay. of the jalapenos or what? I guess, yeah, yeah. You know, so so we we you actually our red sauce is, okay. is nothing but chile de árbol, which is actually a lot spicier than jalapeno. Is it really? Uh, okay. Yes. I can yes, tell. Yeah, definitely. because I, my mouth was burning. Oh look, they just made it for me. Maybe give, give them a, yeah. Oh yeah, here, give me a green sauce. I love it when sure. men feed me. You got a lot of big meat waiting for me, don't you? He's, he's <laughs> he is a gentleman. Okay, here. Um, okay, so you know what? While I put taco, um, let's talk about what inspired Takisa Palacios. Okay, so you you were just mentioning first of all, and let me just say the agua de piña is bomb. Okay, I love oh, it so wow. much. Room temperature is like. Okay. So you were just mentioning how you were just doing like a concrete business and all that. What made yeah, you wake so, up one day and say, you know, I'm gonna do this? So well, well actually, the 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 tacos have been. I actually been in my family for for a long time. Oh, got you. So, okay. So my mother actually she is actually um, a cook. You know, oh and, yeah. And uh, oh, I heard your mom be making some tamales. Man, oh, I heard she be making them. The best. Yeah, I, I, I do. I did hear she be cooking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Everything so, she makes. Yeah. Good. Wait, next time she makes some, I will definitely bring. Let, let me know, please. Yeah, okay. Sure. Yeah. Well, um, so back in in I say I want to say like 2010, uh -huh. we had we actually had a taco stand here in Waco. And it, it was actually on 25th Street and uh, Gorman. We started off from 25th and Gorman. Mm -hmm. And um, at um, well, he's he's like my uncle Chaco, Kuti's dad. Uh, oh, I love Kuti's. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So so um, we were actually at at Chaco's Tire Shop uh, for for a while, but then uh, you know some some stuff ended up happening, and okay. we ended up having to moving moving the to Taco Stand. Oh, got you. So okay. we moved we moved a little further up to 25th and Grim. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, right behind. Uh, I don't know if. You remember the old Club Crush when it was on 25th uh, Street? The, who doesn't remember Club Crush? <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> the place where we never all wanted to admit that we went to. So, so there you go. So, um, so yeah. So we were actually right behind that. Oh, got well, you. In front of it, actually. Okay, really. okay. And um, so you know, it was it was we were there for a while, you know. But um, you know, some uh, some family things ended up happening, mm -hmm. and um, you know, we ended up shutting down. But um, we've always actually had like like cooking in our family at all, like 
always. Okay. You know, my dad, he does he does carnitas and barbacoa. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh I love and, some uh, carnitas. Ooh, crunchy. Mm. Oh, his are so oh, yeah. good. Yeah. Ooh. And you know what? Special shout outs to them. Yeah. Shout oh, out yeah. to my, my mother-in-law and, and, yeah. and my I'm going to have her cook for me one day. Why you, are you telling that story of stuffing my face with yeah, the no, pasta? No, oh, my no. God, <laughs> you guys. Oh, they're so delicious. I can sit here. My, you got to try one. I promise later. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, well, the al pastor, she's the one that actually actually taught me how to, how to how make it. Your mom yeah. taught you how to make it. Okay. Well, my mom really taught me how to do, like, all of it. My okay, dad taught you. me the seasoning. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But my mom is actually the one that, that taught me, like, the chiles and what all to put in it. For sure. Yeah, she... She taught me how to do all so, that. So the cooking side really came from your side of the family, yes. like yes. in regards to like, because yeah. your mom and dad both cook yeah. all the time. Okay, mm-hmm. God. what do they do? Do, uh, do they? So my dad, my dad, my mom actually, she's um, she does the tortillas at Ranchito. I love Ranchito. Yeah, yeah. She, yeah. She, I had to go up there actually, and turn up one time. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> we, 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 we all have. Just, yeah, just one time. It was that one time we yeah. were all drunk, slutty. You know what yeah. I mean? <laughs> <laughs> okay, the fun times. That's it. <laughs> yeah. So you know, she actually, but um. We're actually in the process of, of of getting trying to get her something open for herself. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay. Yeah. So, know, so so Lupe, when he tells you, "Hey, I'm gonna start this taco business and everything," because surely you had like a stable job at the time, right? And I know that it's really yeah. hard to like, I guess, make those decisions, especially as a couple. How did you feel about that? Well, I feel like we matched pretty good because mm. he does like the whole like, you know, his his mom, you know, his family does like all the food and stuff. Yeah, yeah. But I have like the Hey, let's get it. Let's do it. We okay, because you mentioned earlier that you were a go-getter. Yeah, right. Yeah, for she sure. Is. So I think mm-hmm. we kind of matched in that way. Okay. So. He, mm-hmm. he was like, well, you know what? He wants to be his own business, you know, mm-hmm. uh, boss. So I was like, uh, well, baby. Let's, let's, let's do it. it. Okay, yeah. got you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I feel like I got a cilantro in my in my no, eyes. You're Sorry. Good. Okay. No, you're good. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. You just yeah. have sweat. Why you gotta call me Lupe? We can fight right now. <laughs> it was the red hot sauce, y'all. Yeah, no, yeah, I got it. Was got red hot sauce. Yes. It was. Okay. But, but yeah, we matched pretty good on that. So you were just like, okay, we're gonna go for this. Yes. Okay, got gotcha. you. And let's yeah. do it, yeah. So okay, sure. um we we can't we can't see the tray, but I mean, it's a beautiful, beautiful setup that you guys have here. Okay. So if you guys can listen, I just ate the al pastor taco while he was talking to me. And then we got the um this is the Carne asada? Uh-huh. Yes. All right, and then we got the chicken, chicken. Yes. taco. But you guys yes. also make barbacoa tacos as we well. We do barbacoa right. and chorizo. We actually have a chorizo taco in there as well. Oh, you do? Oh, that we did shit. I didn't get it. But yeah. Yeah, and that is that is actually homemade my mother's recipe. Really? Yes. Okay. I was yeah. going to say, how much of the, the meat is it that you guys actually... So you mentioned that the chorizo so is So every, everything, is is, okay. everything is literally made from scratch. Even so, the tortilla? No, 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 no. Oh, okay. not yet, not yet. Andrew, not yet. we can fight right now. Yeah. No, no but I'm saying it's really good. It's good. Yeah, okay. So, so that's 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 one of the secrets that's behind the taco. Thing, yeah, mm. that's a yellow corn tortilla is always gonna set off the taco Absolutely. no matter what. I can't stand no matter no, what. No flour no ass matter. tortilla. Yeah, I can. Yeah. <laughs> so you know, but uh, but yeah, man, you know, like like I said, you know, the the al pastor is is uh, we do. Uh, my mom taught me how to do a, a chile sauce that she marinates it in. And, you know, that's that's her own recipe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know, um. And uh, the the asada, the carne asada, is is pretty much like a beef skirt, mm-hmm. you know, um, seasoned with my father's seasonings, you know. Really, a, li- oh, so a little bit, of, a little bit of everything. You yeah, know? I got you. And um, yeah, so uh, do you love having a man that can just cook? <laughs> I do. Well, I, I, can't, I can't really cook. But oh, you can, can say okay. I can cook, but you can make but, some damn tacos. That's yeah, all I need. No, sure. but man, <laughs> when it comes down to the grill, man, it's it's, it's like a different we feeling. It. It's, yeah. it's it's a different mm-hmm. feeling. You know, it's like it's like a getaway. You know. Now the stove, that's me. Yeah, Lovely. yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh. yeah most definitely. Yeah. I I could burn some shit up on the stove. <laughs> yeah, you know. Excuse my excuse my my. My language. Your language. But, uh, <laughs> Have you heard the shit that I said on the show? <laughs> <laughs> I just got done trying yeah. to slide in your DMs, for Christ's sake. And Lupe's going to whoop my ass. <laughs> oh, no, no. I've said some pretty deplorable shit on this show. <laughs> and I don't give a fuck. That is it. Well, yeah. I mean, it, it's it. the public affair. You That's know? the yeah. public so, affair. You, know, you already know how we get hey, down on this. Yeah, right? for the sure. The tape is on there for a Listen, yeah. 97 episodes-ish in. I'm, I don't give a shit anymore. Okay? Yeah. Yo, yeah, yeah. Get yeah, out of my definitely. fucking DMs with your bullshit. <laughs> I said I'm tired of it. Yeah. How could you say that? Please, all right. <laughs> I got shit to do. I'm trying to go to bed. It's eight o'clock. That's, that's okay. it. Yeah. I have to recreate grind here to try to get late. And y'all trying to remember about my fucking language on the show. Don't watch it. <laughs> no, please watch it. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. Anyway, I'm sorry. Go ahead. That's right. funny. Yeah, so, but. so you start Takisa Palacios. What was the feeling like when you were like, okay, I'm gonna announce this? Because you know, I think that when anybody starts an endeavor, like similar, like when I started the public affair, I really had no idea well, it'd be like more than five episodes, and then yeah, it's pretty much it's um, it's just like like any <laughs> type I'm of excited, I'm sorry. any type. <laughs> The onion fell in my mouth. Okay, oh. <laughs> he just he looked excited about the question. Right? Okay. Man, so uh, it's it's like once you start like your own business, man, right, it's, right. It's, it's uh, 
you're nervous and scared because you know it's like man well, like you have negative thoughts in your mind you're like For sure well, well you know what if it doesn't go good what if there's this? always what the if what that? ifs right. yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. and and you know one thing that that my father-in-law actually told me you know and, and he was like uh because I actually learned how to do concrete from from my father in law and my brother in law. So oh, got you. It's each and every single one of them has taught me a little bit of everything. You okay, know, and, and you know, shout and, and to shout out to them, well. them oh, for yeah. sure. My brother in law is my father in law. My mother and uh, your mother in law. Yeah, my, my mother in law the most because <laughs> she's 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 just like she's just like my wife. You know, she's like mm-hmm. she's persistent. Well, do it, do it, do mm-hmm. it. You know, and and you know, and it's like, well, you know, at the at the end of the day, you know, you need somebody in your corner that that's gonna push you to do it. Absolutely. I'm so, uh, wasting my fucking time. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and so, uh, so you know, and, and and the concrete business, you know, it wasn't really like something that I that I knew anything about okay. until I got with with my wife. With your wife, okay. And um, you know, well, that's what they do, and that's what they dedicate themselves to. And bam, mm-hmm. and even with that, you know, it was like I was scared to do it, but hey, at the end of the day, you know, you just got to do it. Yeah, for sure. You know, just do it. <laughs> Were they good? <laughs> <laughs> oh man! But, but <laughs> on on a Takisa note, okay. I only so. took like that one other time. But anyway, oh, man. <laughs> but but no, like no, I'm, not, I'm sorry. I, they're just really irresistible. Here, let's put the plate down. All right. <laughs> so so with the Takisa, you know, mm-hmm. it, was, it was like, well, you know, there's a lot of taco stands here in Waco. Uh-huh. You know, what if they don't like them? What if this? What if that? And and you know, at the end of the day, I'm like, well, you know, at the end of the day, if if they don't like it, they don't like it. Mm-hmm. But it's it's something. Seasoning from our culture, you know, from from mm-hmm. from where we are from, right, where my sure. family's from. Oh yeah. So where where her family's from and where from my family's from, they're they're neighbors. Mm-hmm. And you okay. know, it's, it's like it's from tierra, in Mexico. It's tierra caliente, you know. Okay. So we're south of Mexico and they're Guerrero. Yeah. Oh, so, okay. so, we're, so, we're, so, we're literally so you guys between, are like, yeah. like, okay, got you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and, and so you know, like these these shoes, like I don't know if you've seen our logo. Our logo is like a like a taco with it's a, a little hat taco, and yeah. like, like little guaraches. It's, it's a sombrero and some guaraches, which are these, you know. Oh, you're both wearing them. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. And so you know, it's I should have got some. Oh, we can get you. I'm wearing these Nike. Yeah. From three yeah. years ago, we, we yeah, for sure. I hate buying fucking shoes. Yeah. Oh, I can't stand tell, shopping. Tell me about yeah, it. I, I, don't it. I, I don't. I don't yeah. shoes at all. I didn't mean to be stuffing my face while you were talking. It's just. Oh really no, you're good. good. That's good. That's I, don't, good. I don't. That's, I don't. I normally don't shows. eat during the show, but I'm like, holy that's, shit! I can't. That's put what these we down. made it for. You know, like, I'm really. I'm them. not taking that to suck anymore. I'm taking that off from you. Well, it's yours. Yeah. Yeah, man. But uh, you know what? And I was gonna say too, because you guys mentioned about Mexico and the seasonings and all that stuff. Um, I like you have never had a good taco till you took your ass to fucking Mexico, Mexico. Oh, bro and they're, man. T- they're sweating like I am now yeah. and grabbing your taco with their sweaty ass hands okay, yes. and giving it to you and it's only 10 pesos and it's like yeah. yes okay. you're like dang 10 pesos I, okay. no I did I'm not I came back sick as fuck but they were it was everything was worth it yeah. <laughs> yeah. you know yeah. And so that's what I say, man. It's, mm. But, you know... It's hard to take that leap of faith. No, it really is. Because it, it I think is. that when we all start endeavors, like I was saying earlier, even when I started this show, it's like you never know what the expectation right. is. Yeah. You know what I mean? But then you also don't know until you try. Yeah. yeah. You know what and, I mean? And so far, man, we have gotten such a good feedback and we appreciate man, all of yeah, you so every, much. Each and every single one of Family, y'all. Family, no, no friends. Lie. Honestly, mm-hmm. we, we appreciate this, this love y'all are showing us because... Yeah. You know, I feel like y'all are mm-hmm. motivating us to keep going. Yeah, they yeah. really are. You, you yeah. guys have gotten really good notoriety. Like I said, mm-hmm. I don't even think the post was up there for five minutes until everybody right. was in my DMs talking about Takis Palacios. Yeah. I was like, yeah. who is that? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was yes. like, what, what differentiates you? Because there's there's quite a few Takisas in town, and a lot of them are good. Right. You know, and some of them are not. And so, <laughs> what, what would you say differentiates what you do versus like what they got going on? What's your input there? Well, on on that note, it's like I say, like our culture is 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 a completely different culture from Mm -hmm. like from people from Zacatecas or people from San Luis, you know, it's, it's like I say, you know, there's, there's different ways of making barbacoa. Like a lot of people make barbacoa brisket, you know what I'm saying? Oh, okay. We don't, we don't use brisket. Oh yeah. We use cow cheek. Cow cheeks? Yeah, mm-hmm. cow cheek. Where do you it's, even buy that from? It's a, <laughs> from Matanzas. Really? From Yeah, you can buy it from any meat market. Like the Michoacana and shit? Mm. Yeah, you can uh, buy it from the Michoacana why, too. But why she said it like that? So, <laughs> so they, they, they sell it, but but they don't say it in, sell it in like bulks. Oh, uh-huh. You know, so so they, they'll sell you like a little bit, but that's that's literally for like yeah. two tacos, three tacos. Oh, uh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, so, you know, but... uh. But that's that barbacoa is a longer process. We didn't make we didn't make that one today. Right. But but when we make it, I will definitely bring you some. No. So you yeah. Can try yeah. Mine. Okay. Yeah, man. But um, I yeah, got you. So so in our reality, I feel like our culture is what what differentiates us. Okay. From any other ta- taquisa. Yeah. Because you know, uh, there's there's some taquisas that are from the same from place we're from. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And you know and and you know hey you know yeah, all for yeah. it you know yeah but, for sure. But like I say you know there's each culture has a different taste and. 
I got you. I feel like that's what differentiates us. Lupe, what say you? You sound like you have a different input. Well, I know. I feel like it's it's about the same, but, Uh you know, mine's more, like, cornier. Uh, I I would say on my behalf, I feel Uh like it's it's our culture, but also, like, the love and the unity that we put into our food as a family, Mm -hmm. as a team. Mm -hmm. You know, I feel like that. Because we... We have had tacos and just 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 from the freaking the beginning, they're right. so rude. Just to yeah. even just, oh, yeah. I'm like, okay, your your food is good, <laughs> right, but right. You're just like, a, I don't but why you acting like your shit don't stink? Yeah, yeah, oh. yeah. yeah, yeah. You know? Oh no. And and I feel like we're not. And some of like them that. from here, right? <laughs> 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 just say some of them are from here. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. like you don't sure. shut up. No, yeah, no. Yeah. I will say I love some, I love me some Mexican taco over there and 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 Yeah, <laughs> you know that place, Mexican taco. Yeah, they only take cash. All right, I guess I'm on my keyboard. Anyway, is it Mexican taco? That's what it's called, right? Next to George's? Oh, are they still up? They're, they're, they're no they're longer open. They're not? No. Man, but they work they, good. What they, happened? They they're, they're chori queso and they're trompo. Yeah, oh my yeah, God. Yeah, I didn't know they yeah, closed sure. down. Yeah, yeah they, 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 cl- they actually closed down about a year or so ago. Did they really? Yeah. Oh, shit. Just, uh, rest in peace to them. <laughs> <laughs> they had like that really spicy salsa too, huh? Yeah. yeah like, six, 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 them onions, them onions, remember? They had the onions that were spicy as shit. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. No, but I didn't mean to interrupt you. No, 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 you're good. But that was it. Okay, got you. Okay. Put into it. So so let's talk about you guys running the business as a couple because <laughs> surely I mean you guys are with each other all the time right. and couples yeah. fight and everything and then mm-hmm. you know I, I you know I had the Garzas on this episode also as barbecue who I love yeah oh which uh, which we, we definitely we wanted to try this weekend oh they're yeah. so they're, 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 that cup they're that cup, they have yeah. oh yeah that's God. that's what I was telling her about yeah, yeah it is so delicious and that yeah. that, that, that couple is delicious and I love them and so <laughs> you know uh, and uh, they were say, like I remember Juanita saying something and I don't want to like like whatever paraphrase it if you will or take words out of her mouth that's what i'm looking for okay. but she said something like you know in the beginning people would go to her for like a price and then they didn't like it and then they would kind of go behind her back and ask him mm-hmm. like to like like garnish it you know what i mean or like you know okay. whatever yeah so do you guys like what what is it like for you guys to run Takisa palacios together as a couple like do you guys butt heads a lot and stuff like that or and how do you stay above all the fray I no. feel like like bumping heads. We really don't. Okay. And and at the end on on that note, you know, communication is key. Yeah. You know, because because when we first started it, you know, people would ask us, you know, like, hey, well, you know, how much for a party of this? How much? Pro-? At the end of the day, you know, it was like, well, damn, you know, we just barely started. We haven't gotten that far. Right. Yeah. You know, we haven't made a a, a menu to where we can be like, oh, for a hundred people and hundred fifty people. Oh yeah. You know, we can't just think of it like off the back of our minds. You know, because right. like automatically at, be expensive. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, yeah. it's like they they probably don't realize, but you know. The prices of meats are 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 at like all time high Everything right now. Oh yeah, and it's, for sure. It's like your beef. Now. Your beef is one of the highest paid. Like one of the oh highest. yeah, I heard beef went up. It's, it's yeah, it's it's <laughs> high. You know? It's like yeah, it went up. <laughs> Lupe, stop. <laughs> so we're talking know, about a different kind of beef. <laughs> You're making so, an easy no sweat, or is that me? It's the hot room. Yeah. It's in the air on. No, you got, it's not. no, but um, okay. but yeah, you know. It's, well, you know, you could, okay, because I will say this too. Like, you know, um, I think a, a, the mistake a lot of people make that when they're starting an endeavor is that they do want to start off automatically. Yeah. X, like, like, oh, I'm already the they shit. Be successful. Oh, no. You know, yeah. like I, I'm, and, I'm five star. I'm this. You know, and there's nothing wrong with wanting to be successful. No, and, not, you know, not wrong. Thinking, yeah. thinking that you know, like, oh, well, my, I'm the best. Well, you know, at the end of the day, you can't fall back on you. Well, you have to showcase what you got. And even at the cost, in the beginning, I'm saying, because let me tell you, I'll share this, like, since we're so many episodes in already. When I started this and I had my first sponsor on episode three, and I think at that time I was only charging, like, I think I only charged like 10, 15 bucks or something like that. Mm -hmm. It wasn't shit. Now it's a little more. But you know what I mean? We want to actually sponsor you. Yeah, let's talk about it. We'll talk about that. Let's talk about it after the show. Yeah, that's business. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, It's a little more than 10, 15 dollars. You know, but, but, yeah, but, you know, I, I just like I was never first of all I'm not like Nike and Subway I'm not gonna be charging you thousands of dollars oh, yeah, yeah. like who the fuck am I you know what yeah. I mean like you know yeah I got some hundreds of views and stuff like that but I I still like to this day don't even think that I'm up to some tier where I should be charging an astronomical amount right. because we're all just like local and yeah. we're all just like starting down here you know what yeah. I mean and we all want to come up up here and whatever mm-hmm. you know and so I think that's where a lot of businesses fail off the bat or I shouldn't yeah. say businesses but like a lot of local endeavors fail off the bat because yeah. they want to just go in head first I mean does that make sense like it, you know it does. I don't want to sound stupid no like, no you, you no. don't it, yeah. but I feel like we, we've we started and we always want to have it and we want to end it and you know mm-hmm. humble mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's, mm-hmm. that's it that's, that's, you, know you gotta be it. nice to people Yeah, yeah. I'm sure. so happy that you said that shit no I really am because yeah. I was talking to one of my good friends Jake Harbahal the other day on the phone and we were talking about like you know running businesses and mm-hmm. stuff like that and I said you know I really think that people fuck with me because I'm nice to everybody 
you have to be nice yeah. to everybody. You can't For be sure. bashing other businesses. Yeah. No. You can't be over here throwing people in, through the mud. You know what right, I mean? No, it's, like, no. it's like, and what for what benefit? Right. You know it, what I mean? It, it don't benefit nobody. And it just no. makes you At look all. bad. It makes yeah. it. Well, it makes yeah. me not want to do business with that person. Yeah. For sure. Like mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Like so if so if one thing goes wrong with me and you, you're gonna bash. You're gonna drag me through that. Mm. No. You know, like, yeah, you know, but, yeah. but you know, it's just it just gives us a different perspective of that person. of that person. Yeah. Okay. How do you guys stay above the fray when it comes to things like that? Because you guys are a small local business. There's obviously a lot of tequisas that you guys. Are probably rivaled with you, it could be a friendly no, rivalry, no, or whatever. Not, not, not even, oh, okay. And I hope we you know, never get to that. Yeah, because because right. at the end of the day, there's there's more than enough people for I say, everybody to, to I contract s- each other. Absolutely, I say yeah. rivaled in this in the ter- like in friendly terms, like you know, okay. like uh, you know, like they there's this taquisa that offers the yeah. same thing that you guys do. Oh, right. well, there, so there hasn't been a situation where you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm used to it coming to me. <laughs> there hasn't been a situation where you guys have had to face at, at this okay. at this moment and at this very time. No, okay, no, good. hasn't. You know, and, and if it was to come to it you know at the end of the day hey you know do you guys ever think about how you might handle because you know I think a lot of people are quick to go on social media and the like negative backlash is something really hard not to respond to right, right. and you have you really have to learn to stay above the fray yeah. I mean I, I don't re- there's some things I just don't respond to and, and you, know? So, so, <laughs> so, you know social media like bashing horrible, somebody on social media is like yeah. probably one of the worst things that you could do. I feel that way because yeah. it's like man like somebody can just screenshot it and even if you delete it it'll still be there right right and you know and, and it'll always follow you no matter what right I, and I feel that way too a lot of people have to really watch with it like i understand that you'd be mad at somebody right yeah. mm-hmm. and i understand that you know you might be mad at let's say they're mad at takisa palacios you know what i mean they right. have one bad experience right, with you right. and I, I really feel like it says a lot about that person when they're yeah. like oh they had roaches in the in the thing whatever it was that one time you know what i mean hopefully never what i'm saying you know you see what i'm saying yeah, yeah, like yeah, don't yeah, use sure. your bad it, this is where I'm going with this. Don't use your one bad experience to ruin everybody. To ruin else's experience. everybody else's yeah, experience. Yeah. And what just drives me even more crazy too is the people that ride in that bandwagon. Like, y- oh, do you yeah. see what I'm talking about? Like, y'all yeah. didn't even get Followers. an opportunity to experience mm-hmm. it. Right. Go have your own personalized hey, opinion and, about it and, and move on. That's it. And you, you know, know, one one thing that 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 we get a lot, you know, is mm-hmm. like I was for this guys. Oh, I love this. Each mm-hmm. each and every single one of them is it's not that powder stuff, you know. It's no. that you can buy. Fruit. You can buy. <laughs> <laughs> not that North Waco not, stuff. Not that North Waco. Stuff. <laughs> I thought y'all were from North Waco. We are. We are. Uh, we are. Yeah, we are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, oh, because um, we were talking about cocaine. Yeah, cocaine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In North Waco. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we don't do that powder. No, stuff, okay, good. No, this is not powder. I will no, say no, that. No, that's okay. that's, that's actually fresh pineapple. Okay, got you. Yeah. So each and each and every single one of our hours that we that we offer, you know, it's it's yeah from scratch literally right. from scratch okay like we offer jamaica tamarindo Ooh, um melon limonada <gasps> limonada con pepino yeah. we, we offer we offer quite a, we offer quite a few <laughs> you know so um i love jamaica oh yeah, yeah. Oh, so baby good. and yeah mm, like with a little sprinkle. little shot of just a little that's, that's <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like any of the aguas if you put any of that Oh yeah. Be good. So we, yeah, we should yeah. have oh, yeah, this weekend. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Well, <laughs> well this, this, weekend. this this weekend that just passed, you know, uh-huh. we had a we had a baptism, my boy Daniel Colazzo. Uh, did you guys cater the baptism? Yes, we yes. did. Okay, bet, and, yeah. and everybody enjoyed the food. We actually they're we really got rid of delicious. Almost yeah. all the food. Yeah. And so uh well one of his guests, you know, mm-hmm. he got we had we had agua de melon, <laughs> limonada con pepino, and horchata. Oh yum. So he he went he went back to back for the melon. Yeah, yeah. Boom, you know, he was he was pulling it and pouring it. He would go back, and then, and then all you would see is just him just. Oh yeah. shit! So you know oh, man, he was spiking it. Man, like, he said it was so good, yeah. was so good that it was going so good with that crown. Yeah. Oh really? He was like crown, crown in this man. Oh man, we, it's bomb. Yeah, I wish we could have did that with this, but I'm just gonna confess to the the viewers, and I told you guys already <laughs> off camera. But when I had Martin Rodriguez on this episode, Mike, I'm sorry, I was a drunk slutty mess on that show. I was, I drank the whole bottle. I was, yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> he's, he's throwing the thumbs up. I was so drunk. We had, we had to stop several times. I don't know what happened because on my earlier episodes of the Public Affair, I used to go, I used to come in, I used to come in fucked up. I used to come in just drunk, and I was like, we're not gonna do it anymore. I don't know what made him different. Hey, we missed out. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> We no, you didn't. That, that, that would have been fun. I feel bad for my editor Allison and Mike because then they have to sit there and chop shit. Yeah, <laughs> I was dr- I was really trying not to slur my words, so I said, "Okay, we're gonna take it easy with the drinking on the show." And, and that's my husband. I was like, "Do hey, you think we should take some Patron?" Just yeah, okay. it would. I mean, I probably would end up really flirting with him. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, okay. she, me and her, it would have been. It would have well, turned you know into what? me and her fighting. Day, no, I feel like I, no, I feel like what's for me is for me, and, and, and I'm for and, her. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. You so go. what's so your? Yeah, we, wouldn't, anyway. we wouldn't be fighting. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I got. So you're saying I can't pull your man? That's what you're saying. 
I, I feel like if, okay. you, if you can, then that would be yours. I would have fight. I mean, I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm not gonna do that to you, bro. Yeah, okay. no, 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 worry. Because this, this, yeah. this, this, this is us. You know oh, okay, yeah, for us. sure. I look, yeah, okay, you sure. know, okay, fine. My chances are. <laughs> anyway, so no, you know what? You were just talking about the spiking your drinks because I, I wanted to ask this question too. You know, so you guys are probably spo- um, not sponsored. Um, did a lot of events, so to speak, or you we've, know, we've, here and there. You know, since since we've started, I can think of. We've done possibly about we and we barely just started. No, you guys yeah. just no, yeah, you guys just are fresh. Yeah. Yeah. But what I can say like is two years we've, old. We've like, probably no, not, not even two, not two years, years old. old. Two, two minutes months. old is what I meant to say. We're, we're yeah. going two on months. two months. <laughs> yeah, we're going okay. on two months. Yeah. But um, from from what I can say is it's pretty much like every weekend mm-hmm. we've had one one event. Oh, good. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Just this this last weekend we've had two we had two events on the same day. So have you guys had those kind of events where everybody's like a drunk slutty mess? And how do you guys? Oh, not yet. Not yet. How how are you gonna work with that? Because I'm sure that that's really hard to work with those types of people. So, you know what so I mean? man, so drunk <laughs> drunk people mm-hmm. and tacos, mm-hmm. it's a match. Mm-hmm. It's a yeah. match. Mm-hmm. It's a match. Cause I like, got fucked up over like, the weekend and so, like, so, I did. Yeah. So okay. so it's like back then when, when yeah. Alasan was, you know, what I'm saying up and popping. Okay. Where would you go after Alasan? Pollo Palenque, right? Tacos, oh, I love Pollo Palenque. There you have it. Yes, and, okay. and it's like you know, it's it's a must. You yeah, know? So, it is. Yeah. So I feel like like us in a drunk in a drunk environment. Yeah, for with sure. Tacos. Oh, so oh, it's just man, a it's gold mine for you guys. It's gonna be a hit. Well, so I that's mean, why yeah. you look sad when you said that. Like not yet. <laughs> no, no. I, f- I feel like uh, I don't know. Is it, I feel like if we if we maintain okay. Okay. Anyone, anyone could be slutty, and we're gonna serve you, and we're gonna be, and we're gonna oh, be. Oh, cool. that's what you were talking about. Yeah. Oh, well, oh. no. I, <laughs> well, that, that's. I, I thought it was like you know, like. No, I meant like in an environment. No, you got the like right. Like in a drunk, you like both a have drunk the, environment. I, okay. When I say drunk yeah. slutty, because that's, I, that's I always. Why, <laughs> that's why I was like, like, oh well, you know, drunk people in tacos is like, oh, it's but, a but slutty people in tacos match too. That, I'll, I, well, I just act I, like I think people in general in tacos is a match. must. I you act know? like everybody's like me when they get drunk because when I'm drunk, I'm very hoary. <laughs> I'm very yeah. slutatious. And, and you know, teach his own. Open business <laughs> for everybody. Yeah. You guys like that too, isn't she? She well, not well, okay. for everybody, but but you know, for for us. <laughs> no, yeah, for you, yeah. Man. Okay, yeah. But I'm not yeah. really like a big drinker, honestly. She's not. No, yeah. I, I, I like did, I've been sitting on this freaking beer for like It's probably already hot. I but I, 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 I honestly cut uh, back. I did go day good. drinking over the weekend because you know I was celebrating uh, as of the recording of this show, of this episode, the only episode out right now is the one with Adasa from Disney's Encanto. And, mm, and I was sweet. I yeah. celebrated because I love her. And yes. That's, I, you know, that's, sweet. Yeah. that's 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 a big achievement for you, you know. Thank you. Yeah. I congratulations on that. Thank you. Thank you guys. Oh stop. No, you oh, are. thank you guys. Yeah, and we it, definitely she, give credit when it's due. Uh, yeah, for sure. I, I appreciate that, guys. Job. No, she said, she, and I will just say, just real quick, she she said some of the kindest things to me. You know, for somebody mm-hmm. that I've loved since I was 15 years old to take it's, the time when she that was not in her agenda, that was not in her schedule. Said, so, yeah, you know, you've yeah. always supported me. I'm gonna support you now. Yeah, that, that's how it was. So, that's a shout out to you. But you know, um, this is about yeah. you guys. Okay, so, no, no, yeah. No, no. Okay, um, yeah. Okay, so so basically, the the, the drunk party that that's we, your. We haven't we haven't yeah, done it. yet. We haven't done it just yet. Okay, let's talk about what you guys oh, I'm sorry what were we going to say I with junk party okay no gotcha yeah, okay. No. let's, let's talk about uh, yeah yeah welcome. just give us a call man yeah, hey, just give them a call okay, okay. Yeah. they got okay. you they, they said yeah, they're yes. going to do it um, we, we have to wrap up soon but I do want to talk to you about um, what you guys offer in regards to like the catering and all that so so you, there's no Takisa Palacio there's no like stand yet no, no, no storage it's not, yeah, it's not, okay. a, it's not a, a store or anything, you know, we're just, um, it's just a, a family owned, you know, uh, mm-hmm. flat grill, you know, a table set up, you know, with for, the tent, for parties. Yeah. We'll come to the party. Yeah. I love it best. The best. Yeah. yeah you know? Okay. But um, we offer, we offer, you know, a little bit of everything, you know. Okay. Got you. So what you can say is uh, your tacos, tacos for sure, your aguas frescas. Yeah. And then um, your, your charro beans and your rice. Oh, so you, you guys know? do sides we too. Offer, we offer, we also oh. offer those as well. Oh. So, you know. We have we have like um, like I say, you know, at the end of the day, you know, mm. it's it's not it's not cheap, right? To, to supply everything, absolutely. But you know, that's that's where our prices come into, like, yeah. Oh, well, you know, this is how much we're asking, mm. and you know, and and you know. Well, can I just say that whatever you guys are like asking in regards to price for like it's so fucking worth it. Like even when he was talking just a minute ago and I started choking (laughs) on my taco. I mean, I love choking on some meat. Don't get me wrong, but this meat was definitely worth choking on for sure. Not like those roaches. That's the way. No, no, no. But but as far as on the tacos, on the meats, we provide um, asada, asada, Mm. pastor, pastor, chorizo, Mm -hmm. uh, barbacoa. And, and, and pollo. And pollo. Chicken, and pollo. Chicken. Yeah, chicken. chicken. Yeah, Everybody be forgetting about chicken. That's my yeah. favorite. Yeah. I like, you can't yeah. really go so, on. so, okay. Do you, so, do you make do you make the sides or how, how do you got, like how are you guys splitting up the tasks and all that? Like, so, who does what? 
so pretty much <laughs> on on that note, or it's literally just the face. It's just the so, <laughs> no. yeah, so my mom, my you. mom still kind of helps us out. Oh, know, from okay, time to time, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you know, um, her 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 rice, you know, is is just the softest. Oh, the softest. I have to try it next yeah, event. I'm coming for sure. Okay. You know, and um, uh, and so you know, like I say, you know, she she helps us out, and she still gives us tips. Yeah, because because don't get me wrong, you know, we're we're always a book. You know, we're always okay. absorbing, and and we can learn. Okay. So you know, but no, we, as far as far as I'm sorry, baby. Go ahead, go ahead. No, go ahead. Go but ahead. no, like as far as tasks, I'm not a big meat fan. Okay. I, I don't really like to eat too much meat. Oh really? So he does. He takes care of. Okay. Well, at yeah. least not okay. that kind. <laughs> I was like, you were just over here gassing her up. Right? <laughs> no, not, not that one. Not, not, not like yeah. meat, but the other meats not good animal too. meat. No. Okay, but uh, but as far as like the aguas, <laughs> I, I do not. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I know so, what you're talking about. Go ahead. So yeah, so no, like he normally takes care of like the meat and making sure like it's soft okay. and it's you know that, and then I kind of take care of the rest. Oh, okay, got as it. As far as like the aguas, the sides, the salsa. Okay, so so yeah. you're back cooking the rice. So so when you guys, I, I, you have the flat top grill. So the rice and beans is already made. It's already yes. made. By yes. the time yes. you guys we, we, get make, there. we make those at home. You know yeah. what I love we, about you Mexicans, honestly. <laughs> I went to um, the Franco's baby shower. Um, okay. Sarahi and Abraham Franco, uh-huh. who I love. Yeah. And <laughs> and I've seen this before. Forward to they be putting rice and beans in coolers, like yeah. in coolers that you yeah. put drinks. So, so, you know, <laughs> so so that's <laughs> Which a cooler. It's, it's like a cooler keeps your drinks cold. Yeah, a cooler will keep your food hot. Yeah, it does. Because I was Always. like, I was like, oh, okay. But it was so <laughs> yeah. good. It was so good. It tastes yeah. the same. Yeah. yeah. I just thought that that was really great. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to. But no, we, we, no, but we, we don't use, do it like that. Yeah, no, we use, gotcha. we use those trays. You know, like okay. so. So like an events, like events, like two hundred people events. Then uh-huh. yeah, we would consist of that for sure. But since you know, right I'm now you know too. we've yeah. only we've only done like 50, 50 people, seventy five people. Oh, got you. Okay. Events like that. So mm. you know, one of those charolas is is probably about as much that'll feed about a good seventy five yeah. people. Yeah, this is. I feel like this right here, like we can't see it, but it's a, it's a good little tray like that you get from like H E B or something that yeah. you can put a ham in. Mm-hmm. It's enough to fit a ham. If and, it's so, this this one fits. Perfectly fits twenty tacos. Yeah, your your fixings, you know, your onions, your grilled onions, and yeah. we actually have grilled onions on there too, and chile storiados. Oh, mm-hmm. yeah. So you know, when you take it home, you know, hey, enjoy. You know what? I, I took a picture yeah. before the recording, yeah. and I'm gonna post it at the Public Affairs Facebook yeah. page, and make so, sure you guys you know, go check and, it out. Enjoy it. And Are you gonna make other things too? Because I love getting like quesadillas and tortas mm-hmm. and shit. Yes. So okay. that that is the plan. <laughs> he got so he excited. Got excited. <laughs> you know, but but it's like right now, yeah. right now, we you know we're we're really trying to like start it off. So mm-hmm. you know. This, like I said earlier, you know, this is like the the closest, like the easiest things to yeah, make. Yeah, for sure. And and like on a short notice or whatever, you know, it's yeah. it's, it's the easiest. Right. But um, but yeah, for sure. No, uh, we we plan on later on in the future adding quesadillas. Oh and, yeah. And and possibly even tortas. Okay, and stuff got like you. That. But you know, and and those will be like for the events because at the end of the day, we're here to please the people. Absolutely. Yeah. I so. love getting me a nice greasy ass quesadilla. Mm. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, with just like the mm. lettuce and tomatoes and shit <laughs> like that. You know what I mean? The sour cream and so, it's all just yeah. melting down your throat, <laughs> like that other stuff. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, you know what, God? I, I really loved having you guys on the show. Unfortunately, we are Thank running you. out of time here. Oh, but um, but before we go, um, I definitely want to say what is next for Takisa Palacios. Um, so are you guys like planning on opening like a small little thing it, or? It, 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 it is it is it is a big a big plan yeah to to want to say that that we will open up yeah for sure but it is it is in the future you know okay in the future but as of right now you know i think we're we're gonna stick to local okay got you but um just like events and yeah just events and stuff like that just until up and later on in the future we do a little bit bigger yeah, so so, but it, in the future, yeah, it is it is possible that, yeah. that we will be opening up an actual stand. And how do, how do we, how do we get a hold of you guys to book events oh, and oh, stuff oh, like oh. that? Oh okay, yeah, so, uh, <laughs> this is on, on Facebook we're uh, Takisa Palacios. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're on Snapchat as well, Takisa Palacios, yes. and so, Instagram is Takisa this is our underscore business card. I don't know if you want Palacios. Oh, cute. <laughs> sorry, baby. Sorry, no, sorry, yeah. Sorry. Oh, look at And you guys have the whole menu back here. Yeah. yeah Hello, it's, it's, genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 So sure. I don't even have to like look you up. Uh, uh, let me see. I'm, I want the. Uh, um, <laughs> okay. So so you guys are on Instagram, Facebook, and, and Snapchat. Snapchat. Uh-huh. There, there was one that was different. What was it with the Snapchat? Takis- it was Instagram. It was uh, Takisa underscore Palacios. Palacios. Okay. Mm-hmm. So they can just message you guys on there and yeah. say, hey, I have a birthday party coming call up. Us. Yeah. yeah. I got. And then you guys mm-hmm. just literally go and set up. Is, yeah. it just, is it just you two and the mother or? No, no, no. It's actually. Us too, okay. and, and you know, like since since we have uh, our kids, yeah, every other weekend, um, when if if it if it falls on the day of our kids, mm-hmm. 
Well, we'll have our kids there too. Yeah. Oh, you know man. I said it'd be happy. So it's, it's, yeah. yeah, it's, it's so drinking oh, yeah, tacos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, they work. They work. Yeah. 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 Them toys ain't cheap. So, you know. Yeah, I got you. They, they work. Yeah. No, yeah. I love your son. He's always, yeah. he's always, he's a very, very well mannered boy. Yeah, I will say yeah, that. Yeah. yeah. I've yeah. never met, yeah. I've never. And we, we, we try. We try our hardest yeah. to get them the right way. No, yeah. he, he is definitely the right yeah. way. Sweet. For sure. I appreciate that. So, so you have your son and then you have a son. Do you guys have kids together as well? Yes, we oh, actually have another girl. Oh, okay, and then are yes. we done here? Or? No. Uh, oh, oh no, we need no, more. No, no. Oh. He, want, he wants a lot of kids. I, I want so. eight. Well, I, I guess eight. if you want to run a business with, you know, the cheapest way, you better have a bunch of kids. Okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know I mean? but, yeah. But no, that, that wasn't the way. Eight you know, damn kids. I've, I've, I've came, I came from a big family. You know? Okay, I, I got actually you. have, uh, it's it's eight of us in, in, in total. Oh, really? Yes. Okay, I got you. So, you know, it's, the reason I want a big family is because at the end of the day, you know, it's the support. Yeah, for sure. You know, you have a big family. You have more people to support, like yeah. more, more moral support. You know, so I got you. I yeah. got, and and so Lupe, do you want you want to follow suit and have eight kids? Mm. <laughs> You're almost halfway we'll, there. We'll just, <laughs> we'll just we'll just wait and see. We'll yeah, see. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll but, just but, just stay but, tuned. Yeah, but but coming back to the taquiza. Um, yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> sorry, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's because you know we're here to to kind of advertise this. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. I yeah. want to make sure we do because we work so hard. For, Absolutely. For yeah. what we do have. Yeah. So so whenever we do parties or just any kind of event, uh, we provide our tacos. You know, the meats are pastor asada, mm. pollo, chorizo, and barbacoa. Our agua fresca, their piña, melon, horchata, limonada, limonada con pepino, mm. jamaica and tamarindo. And we also provide for all of your your plates, your cups, your eyes, your silverware, your for, napkins for, 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 for we, our we, stuff. Oh, got you. Spot. Okay. So, so like your, your plates for the tacos, your, yeah. your bowls. Yeah, for yeah you guys rice. brought the whole setup. Yeah. It was that's really that's cute. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's, for that's, sure. that's how we do it. Yeah. Know? The salsas, the limes, the, the grilled sides, onions, the chiles, yep. okay. we offer all of that. Yeah. So, you know, we even offer rabanos. You know, a lot of people don't know about ta- rabanos and tacos. Do you know what rabanos no, are? No, I don't even know what that is. Do you know what radish is? Yes. Not horseradish. Radish. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. So, it's it's, it's, it's like, a, like a red... Um, it's layered. It's it's a red colored. Okay. But on the inside, it's white. Oh yes, yes, yes. I so, do know what that is. Yeah, I love that so, shit. So yeah. you know, yeah. So yeah. Yeah. I do. So I, 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 do. I actually told her, you know, it's like I love it. Whenever I was hungover, but not you know, on tacos, yeah. What, yeah. On anything. Well, I guess so, I've had it on tacos. Yeah. So I usually mm. I, what what I got from those is is pretty much like a hung, hangover. Okay. <laughs> Put some <laughs> limes, some limes, a little bit of salt, and some yeah. peanut sauce. Oh, yeah. Man. Guarantee you, man. It's, it's like yeah. a michelada. Okay. It's like a michelada, yeah. I got you. That sounds really good. Yeah. So, I mean, so, so um, you guys, I mean, just real quick again before they, I know I keep saying that, but, um, <laughs> but you know, so you guys. They're do, ready to go do home, you, huh? Do you use, no, they're good. <laughs> <laughs> do you use, run, so you guys have full-time jobs still outside? No. Of tech, oh, okay. No. No. So this so is, she, so, so she, she was, she was actually a stay-at-home mom. Oh. And, and I was, I was life. more on the, yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, uh, I had yeah. a full-time job. Uh-huh. I was actually a maintenance mechanic at Pilgrim's Pride. Oh, got you. But, um, you know, I, I ended up pursuing that I want to be a businessman and I want to spend more time with my family. Oh, I was working you. second shift, so. Oh, yeah. I was gone from literally from 1 o'clock in the afternoon to about 11, 30, 12 Oh, the whole day. Night. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. And, uh, you know, the thing that got me the most was my boys always asking me, hey, well, you mm. know, when is when is Nessie? Well, because her, my stepson, her son. He calls me Nessimo. Oh, gotcha. Nessimo, and, yeah. and you know, yeah. like, hey, well, what, why is Nessimo not eating with us anymore? Why right, does Nessimo? Right. Not... One big thing about us is 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 always dinner time. Oh, Whenever okay. we, it's, it's family time. You know, yeah, no sure. phones, no books, no toys, no nothing. It's just we are gonna sit down, eat, and talk. Absolutely. Yeah. And you know, and that's that's a good quality. Yeah, you know, it it is. Have, yeah. And, so and you know, our little girl too, man. Our daughter, oh, she is, so she fun. is, man. She is. <laughs> How is the wild. daughter again? She's eight months. She's eight months. Oh, she's wow. Eight okay, months. yeah. She's you know, fresh, but, yeah. But she's, but man, she is <laughs> something <girl's> funny. else, man. <laughs> yeah. And, and she eats. She eats literally everything. Right, okay. You know? so, so, I got know, you. But uh, yeah, one one big thing on, on our, our behalf is like family. God, I bet that was scary though. So, so Takisa Palacios is... What's going on here? That and, and, and concrete. And the concrete. And concrete. Got you. Yes. Okay. Yeah. That and concrete. And, and so, yeah, you know what? I just want to wish you guys both best of luck with Takisa yeah, Palacios yeah. in any way that right, I can help you guys. Right because back at you. Honestly, I, thank you so much. Yes. No, but honestly, you guys really have a really good thing going on here. I can tell. But when the announcement came out, everybody was really, really yeah. going hard for you Amen. guys. And, and um, I appreciate each and every single one yeah. of you. And, and, and that, as that, they should, yeah. because these tacos are to die for. They're yeah, absolutely yeah. delicious. I can't wait to go home and roll around in the rest of those tacos <laughs> by myself. I was going to take them to Soko Soccer Academy because tonight's soccer night. <laughs> no, honestly thank you both again I, you know we could be here for five hours it was yeah, such a pleasure yeah, man, having man. the both of you on this show i'm really uh, and especially us. you coming i know we we kind of incorporated you kind of 
<laughs> last minute but i'm really hey. happy that you made the time honestly i'm really glad yeah, that both sure. of you guys came <laughs> hey man yeah. we appreciate you for having us yeah. yes of course yeah. no I, 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 I just like what we were just talking about earlier because i know you guys have said that you've watched the show like even yeah, when i was talking has. to you yeah. she's like oh no i watch the show all the time mm. yeah. just thank yeah. you guys for your yeah. support yeah. i truly hey, no, appreciate thank you. it yeah. you know thank you well, of thank course you. keep doing what you're doing you're doing a good job yeah i appreciate it thank you so much see i wasn't that bad right no yeah i didn't i didn't try to take your mans okay everybody always thinks i want to take their mans if i want to take their mans i slide in the two in the morning which i won't do Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Public Affair. Don't forget to follow Takisa Palacios all over social media, Instagram, yes. Facebook, um, Snapchat, Snapchat even. Yeah. Wow. But, you know, so, okay, and um, you hit them up for your party. Mm. Hit them up for quinceañeras, birthday parties, um, anything. baby shower, anything. If Weddings, just, divorces. Divorce, yeah. Anything. No, you just know, do it for yourself. You name yeah. it, yeah. got it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. slut yeah. parties, yeah. slut parties. These yeah. are great for anything. slut parties. Yeah. yeah, the juice. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and you guys, yeah. hit, hit yeah. them up for everything. These agua fresca, this agua de piña, you couldn't see it in the styrofoam cup, but it is made fresh darling yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> before we go i definitely want to use this opportunity to encourage you guys to like share and subscribe to the public affair thank you guys again for all the support before we go let's go ahead and give a shout out to just a few more of our sponsors of this episode of the public affair this episode is brought to you by soco soccer academy with dominic gutierrez and ariana gutierrez where i'll be taking these tacos next located at 3304 franklin avenue i just can't eat all the tacos by myself i'm on a caloric yeah. deficit okay <laughs> yeah, they offer t- team small group and individual skill training they also have elite skills training to make your kid a superb star athlete they have over Open play on Mondays and Wednesday nights for ages 16 and older at 8:30 with Marl, aka Silly Buns. I call him Silly Buns because he's a little silly buns. It's only five dollars to play, so make sure you follow on Facebook at Soko Soccer Academy and on Instagram at Soko Soccer254. Thank you guys so much for sponsoring this episode of the Public Affair. Of course, to Fat Boy Michelana Botana okay. with Junior Banda. Yeah, I love that guy so much. Mm-hmm. He provides the best Michelana Botana plates for yourself or for a party. The menu has a ton of different items, yeah. including botana bowls, chamoy, okay. pickles, and more. Oh, they're delicious, mm-hmm. locally operated. To make sure you get the best and not the rest. Follow on I Facebook see. and Instagram at Fatboy Michelada y Botana and place your order. Now, Junior Banda has been an advent sponsor of the public affair and supporter and i love that guy so much thank you so much for sponsoring this episode of the public affair and of course to jeffrey monreal with boyo box and audio home for all your led needs and auto accessories installation stereos door speakers and audio systems he also specializes in building custom stuff for enclosures and much more he's definitely a jack of all trades and your one-stop shop to get everything done in one roof jeffrey monreal he's made my car like Super snackish, by the way. Thank you. I, you know, he, he has. I've done some things in the car. But and thank, <laughs> thank, thank God for the tent. That's all I'm going to say. Okay. <laughs> so, Jeffrey pointed out, thank you so much. <laughs> can't, can't go wrong with you, that the, no, yeah. uh, Whatever the lowest was. Uh, which, <laughs> yeah. thank God. Be, it. Is that yeah. what it is? Okay. <laughs> thank you, Jeffrey Monday, for sponsoring this episode of The Public Affair. To everybody who tuned into this episode, thank you guys again so much. Um, big shout out to the Palacios who came on to this episode, Lupe um, Onisimo. Make sure you guys book your next event with Takisa Palacios all over social media. And don't forget, darling, to always keep it between us. (laughs) That's it. (laughs) This has been a Rogue Media Podcast.